Hey everybody, this is Brett, and today I'd like to shed some light on some wars from the past so that people will understand what the true reason for them was. Like for instance, the Vietnam War. For years and years and years, people have said that it was just bad. 58,000 Americans were killed and all, it cost all of this money, etc., etc., etc. The Vietnam War was flown into from the Second World War. America had so many ships and so much equipment, etc., etc. And so, North Vietnam was a communist place, and that was bad against what we stand for. And that's why we got into that war. And so a lot of people say, well, that's not enough justification for that. But now we see with Russia that maybe it was. Because look at their values, okay? And look at other dictatorships. People say, oh, we shouldn't have gotten into Iraq because there were no weapons of mass destruction. Well, that may be true. But Saddam Hussein was a dictator. And dictators and other regimes like in Iran don't get taken down by hippies. They get taken down by capitalist societies that are trying to take over. Everything is like a succession, okay? So nothing is perfect, right? But you don't see like, you're not going to see like people like me being able to take down Russia. I'm not going to go join the army. There are other people that do those kinds of jobs. Remember, everyone has a job. Think about people that are just totally peaceful. That like there are, there are religions that they won't even hurt an ant. They're looking to make sure that they don't step on an ant, okay? So will those people take down the Russians? No. There has to be hamburger-eating Americans that have joined the military, that see it as a bad thing, and Iraq, and uh, all these countries, Syria, etc., that are a bad thing, and we're going to go over there and kick their butts. Does, does this need to happen? Yes, because these are extremist regimes that are going to eventually, they're criminals, okay? So there has to be some kind of an adversary against these people. That includes North Korea as well. And so everything has a purpose. Everything has a purpose. There are people out there that say, well, JFK is, or RFK is a conspiracy theorist, and da 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 da. Okay, look at the value of this person. Look at his value. He's not just a conspiracy theorist, okay? Everyone has a job, remember that. Everyone has a job. And if you see him doing something, that has saying something that has some degree of truth well it probably does okay that's why people are voting for him like me because the other two are just the same old bloody da trump is white collar criminal and biden is just part of the establishment bloody da okay <laughs> so if you want change you have to vote for someone that's different but those are the reasons for America's involvement in wars, and you don't always have to agree with them, but some of them are obvious that we were in World War II to take down the Nazis, and even though Russia was kind of also involved and lost more than anybody else, they lost more people than anybody else, but look at how they did it, you know? They don't even care about their guys. Their, their guys getting killed by the millions, not, not 50,000, by the millions. That's because they're a regime. They're a, 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 an idiot. Like, they don't even care about life. Okay, and that's partially because of the demographics here and where they're located. Remember, the more harsh the conditions are, the harder it is for people to live, and the easier it is for various unethical governments to start taking control, like in Iran. Look at that topography. Look at the topography in Iran. It's, it's like, how would you like to live there? <laughs> I don't. I like it green. 
<laughs> like this. I don't even want to live in Utah where I was born. Look at what that looks like. So anyways, I want to thank you so much for joining me. Look how peaceful it is. See, if you want, you can choose the job of being a laundry, a laundry hanger and just living peaceful. Because, you know, as long as you attract the kind of vibe into your life that you want, well, that's, you know, what you get. Thanks for joining me. Bye.